The use of hydraulic fracturing has made the U.S. one of the top producers of oil and gas in the world. Exploration and production companies utilize hydraulic fracturing to unlock hydrocarbon resources from shales and other challenging formations. Praxair has developed a waterless fracturing technology using CO2. Water is the most commonly used fluid for hydraulic fracturing. The use of water and chemicals can actually reduce the total potential production of those hydrocarbons from the formation into the well. The use of an energized fluid such as nitrogen or carbon dioxide foams made with water can improve initial production rates. This reduces water consumption and the expansion of the gas supplies energy needed to flush the fractures and well for underpressurized formations. The Praxair blender equipment is designed to integrate directly with the service company's frac high pressure equipment. We've reduced the mechanical complexity of the system to increase the operability, reliability, and safety. Each blender is delivered to the site in a horizontal position. It is then hydraulically lifted to a vertical position for operation. The process begins after a well has been drilled and safely cemented and cased to isolate the well from the surrounding environment. In the first step of the well completion process, a special tool creates perforations or holes in the casing or well bore in the targeted hydrocarbon bearing formation. Next, fracking fluid pumped at high rates and pressures is forced through the perforations to initiate and propagate fractures throughout the formation. Propant, often specially screened sand, injected with the fluid serves to prop the fractures open after the fluid pressure is released. This leaves channels through which the oil or gas flow to the well bore and up to the production facilities on the surface. We're looking at additives to enable us to use higher flow rates and also to increase the propant loading that will really make the process a lot more productive and effective for our customers. CO2 can also dissolve into the oil, reducing the density, reducing the viscosity, reducing the interfacial tension, which better allows that oil to flow. In addition, the CO2 can be captured during the flow back process. Typical jobs nowadays are 50 to 100 times larger than they have been historically and traditionally. You've got to have a supplier that can put all the equipment and resources, the dedicated logistics and the production capabilities in place to support your operations when you're doing a job like that. Praxair's dry frack technology is one more example of Praxair making our planet more productive.